Next Level Mindset bringing you another powerful and positive video. I'm going to share with you three reasons you do not want to be on YouTube. Signs that you just probably don't want to start a channel, just don't do it. Things from my own experience, insights on that. And if you stay with me through to the end of this video, I've got an extra bonus pro tip and mistakes you can avoid if you do decide to do it. You do not want to miss this. Let's get into it. So I decided to start my channel over again. I made a restart and a relaunch. And we always talk about the things that people need to do, right? To start a YouTube channel, it's never too late. But nobody's really talking about the fact that you may not really want to do it. These are just a few reasons stood out for me. Let me know in the comment section what stands out most for you. And if you're new, thanks for checking out the channel. So the first sign that you might not want to start a YouTube channel is if you're convinced that you're too old or is that it's too late. If you've got your mind made up about that, somebody can be as old as I am, right? And you can still make it, make it happen. You can do it no matter what your age may be. Or maybe you're on the other side. You think about the fact that maybe you might be too young. What I've learned in my life is it's just never too late to do the right thing. And you're never too old to follow your dream. That's one of the things I say. And so I've decided that, you know what? I'm going to eliminate my excuses. I always say I have eliminated the words I can't from my life. Nothing that is impossible for me. Stepping out on faith, I can do all things through the power of God within me that I am, that great spirit. So that's part of the life that I live and that's part of my part of my goal here at Next Level is to empower you and inspire you just like me. If you're convinced that it's too late, it might be too late because then you won't have that motivation to create. You're not going to have that natural desire to upload your videos. So keep that in mind as you begin to think about YouTube. Is it a good time for it? Maybe you don't need to do it. Maybe you just don't need to start. If you're not able to make your mind up, if you're not able to change your mindset and you're convinced it's too late or that you're too old and that nothing can change that, you might not want to do it. That's a good sign that YouTube is not for you. The second sign that YouTube is not for you if you're looking to get rich quick or do something that is not according to the rules. Think about that. YouTubers are making money these days. I have a goal to go full time to be able to make a living doing something that I love to do. But some people are willing to break rules and violate, do something illegal. That is not what you want to do. I would not recommend that. So that's another sign. If you're into it just for the money and you want to get rich quick, you're willing to break the rules and do something illegal. You're not willing to invest in you and you're willing to break rules and do illegal business activities. YouTube may not be for you. It's all about doing the right thing at the right time. And it's never a wrong time to do the right thing. What I've learned in my journey, even when I started looking at my channel, I restarted it knowing that I could make a living from it. But at the same time, I was able to see that, you know what, this thing might not happen overnight. I'm not looking for a get rich quick thing. I'm willing to put that time in. So I want to encourage you to do the same thing. Maybe that's where you're at right now. Maybe you're on that verge of making that decision. And it's going to take some energy. It's going to take an investment. And other people, they won't see the effort that you put in, right? One of my favorite things I always say, people might see the shine, but they don't see the time. They see the glitter. They see the result, but they don't see the effort, the learning, and all the responsibilities that you are able to take on. They don't see the sacrifices that you made. So if you're looking to get rich quick, or you're willing to break the rules and do something illegal. Now, I always say break the rules in a certain way, bend them in a certain way. But there are certain things that are illegal against YouTube's policy that would get you in a lot of trouble. And if that's you, if you're willing to break the rules on that level, doing something, trying to get rich quick, you might not want to start a YouTube channel. Before we go to this next one, if this is your first time and you want to stay empowered with us or you've been here and never subscribed before, hit that subscribe button, join the family. We'd love to have you as a part of the Next Level community. And the third sign that YouTube is not for you, you might not want to start a YouTube channel as if you're starting another channel just for your short video. But I want to introduce you to this guy. This is Renee Ritchie. He is what they call the liaison for YouTube. And it says right here, he will serve in YouTube as an advocate for creators and will work creatively to help them behind the scenes to understand YouTube. And he said something that is so important when it comes to our short form videos. Let's check out what he had to say. Check this out. If you're already making long form videos on YouTube and you want to get into shorts, should you do it on your main channel or start a whole new channel just for shorts? We get that question so much. Whether it's longs, shorts, or lives, we're continuing to build bridges between shorts, long form, and live. So if somebody discovers your channel through shorts and really enjoys them, when they go to the YouTube homepage, we'll try to recommend your long form videos to them as well. Or if someone's looking at your shorts and your live, we'll 
will tell them. I like that. Big shout out to Re Renee Ritchie for that. No doubt, that was me. I was getting ready to start a whole new channel. You know, everything was confusing. It was no clarity on our homepage and all, almost started a whole new channel just for my short form content. Now, a lot of YouTubers, you're fine. They'll have this same short form content on the same channel as their long form content as long as it's serving that same audience, right? As long as it's serving that same, you can call it a niche or a niche if you want to, but it's really just a group of people who enjoy what you're doing in long form and short form. Maybe you thought about starting a new channel. If it was just for your shorts, you might not want to do that because now they got it where you can put it all on the same channel, doing whatever you've got to do, taking it to that next level. And if you're part of the family, you already know that's how we like to do it to get it done. We want to go to the next level. Everything that we do. Next level mindset. That's where it's at. Now, I got a bonus point that I want to share with you. Extra tips off the script. But first, before we do that, I've got to tell you about my brand new upcoming single. For those of you who follow my music, it's called God's Time. I'm giving away a free download copy of my single, God's Time. Go to take it to the altar music. Leave us an email. We're building our fan base. I want to get that to you. I'm excited about that. And while you're doing that, go on over to Spotify. Stream my brand new single. It's out right now everywhere. Everywhere your music is streamed. It's called Nobody. You can get it on the Amazon site. Put that on your favorite Spotify playlist. Do that with the links in the description. If you've enjoyed this so far and it's giving you value, do me a favor and hit that like button for the algorithm. Help this video to get out to as many people as we can. Thank you. Appreciate that. So this bonus point, this extra tip that I want to share with you talks about being able to overcome things. Maybe you're watching this right now and you are someone who thought it was too late. Maybe you thought you were too old or even too young for that matter. We can rise above it. As a matter of fact, I talk about that in my book, Still Destined for Greatness. Check this out. I talk about when you can choose to respond to everything in a positive way, you will live a powerful life. I go on to say that even if you're going through evolution of society, you can still follow your dreams and realize with satisfaction the fulfillment of every vision that you have in your heart. And I go deeper into that with that book, Still Destined for Greatness. I would love for you to take a copy of that home with you with the link in the description. So think about that, overcome it. And what I learned from my journey, if I still have a desire to share something with the world, it's never too late. Maybe it's the perfect time for you to do that. And you may be watching this right now and you said, you know what, I'm going to do it. You've already made your mind up. Then you could learn from some mistakes that I've made. I want you to check out this video right here. Five mistakes YouTubers make that we can avoid. I think that will be a great video for you to watch next. So check that out. We'll talk again over there. A big thank you to my subscribers and return viewers. You are the life of the channel. I really appreciate you. Thanks again for watching. Stay blessed. Stay positive. Remember, there's nothing that needs to be done that together we cannot do. I'll see you on the next level. Peace.